Hey, what's going on? It's yours truly, Kevin Key with Moon Man DJS, and that stands for Don't Just Settle. Today we're at the bench with the Sony Venice 2 and the new RE High 5 system. We're going to be covering a whole lot of different teaching segments, covering lenses, support, cameras, wireless video, grip gear, camera gear, miscellaneous lighting, and so forth. But today, once again, we're starting with the RE High 5 and the Sony Venice 2. And we're going to break down how easy it is to set it up and work with the zoom lens, which today we're using the OOM 25 to 100. So let's go ahead and break open the case here, get some of the things that we need. One of the things that we need right here is the RIA, which is the RIA. This right here is basically the brain of the High 5 system, and it controls all of your motors. And the interesting thing is with the RE High 5, you can also utilize the, um, the radio motors. And the radio motors basically break down um, by themselves. They have a motor on, they have a radio on the actual motor and that allows it to connect to the hand unit. For situations like this, this RIA gives you a lot more connectivity and functionality because it's not, this camera is not an actual RE camera, so it doesn't have the native intuitive connectivity that the other RE cameras have with it. So for this one, what we're gonna do is we're gonna connect into the remote input here on the back. And then this other cable is gonna go into the cam input. And then follow this to D-tap power, D power on the top. So now you see that the rear powers up. Right now we're actually on channel two. So I'm gonna tidy this up just a little bit. And of course you can use whatever cable management you want. Now, the High 5 comes with a multitude of cables and support pieces and rings and all these other accessories to make it very customizable. But we'll start with our, our motors. So this being a zoom lens, we have the option and flexibility to mount to various, um, various parts of the lens. First one I'm connecting to would be focus. So there's our focus. Now I'm gonna to connect to the zoom. And this works with 19 and 15 millimeter rods. And I'm gonna to go to the other side for my iris, simply because of where my rear is. Which actually, I'm just gonna go ahead and move the rear, as a matter of fact. And the great thing about this RA cage is it just gives you a lot of flexibility to just position things wherever you want to. So now, now we've got all three motors on the side. We've got our iris, our zoom, and we've got our focus there. So now what we're gonna to start to do is to connect the cams, the L bus connectors to them. And you can just jump one to the other. And then finally, let's get a little bit longer.
Let me take this directly up to our bus up top. And you see, as soon as I plugged in power, instantly the motor started flashing. Get a little cable management here. So next we need to grab the hand unit, make sure we have the radio to go with it as well. Click that in, power it up. Then once everything comes up, you see we're in standby, okay? Now it's very important that while you have it set, go to your page, go to your motor setup, and then you have your focus, You've got your iris settings, the torque, the side. You've got your zoom. But also, in your control setup, you want to make sure that they're assigned. So knob, right now, we have it on focus. The slider we have is the iris. The force pad we have is the zoom. And so we can go home. And then we can go to our motor setup, go to our calibration menu, and do all motors. And so now, all of our motors are starting to calibrate. Then once they're all calibrated, you'll see green lights on all three of them. So now, I can go in, pull focus all the way over, and you see how responsive, it's very responsive. Same thing with my iris, and the same thing with my zoom. So the High Five makes it really simple and really easy when you're dealing with any type of camera. And in Moon Men, we have all the cables, so if you wanted to use it with a red, with a black magic, a Canon, any of those, we have all the appropriate cables. And the thing that's also great about this, we have the actual license for the uh, Sony Venice 2. So you can go in, you can change the frames per second, you can change the ND, you can also do playback. You can do all of these things from this hand unit. So that makes it really good. The other cool thing is we have the licenses in it. So you can go in and you can change the ND filters, which are built into the Venice. You can change the frame rate. And you can do um, play mode. You can go into play, playback for whatever you have already previously recorded and control it from the high five. So this really makes it very handy for an AC to where you don't have to touch the camera the whole time. And the same thing goes with start stop. So you can hit record. The camera will start recording by itself with the hand unit. And this is one of the other many things that we at Moon Men think you shouldn't have to do without. It's not that you can't do without it but it's so much easier when you have the proper tools for the job. So be sure to go to moonmenonline.com for other products. We've got great rental specials. Also this LED volume here at the studio if you wanna shoot in front of it to do different projects, series, shows, or just podcasts, public speakings, anything that you wanna just put out there. We also have the equipment ready to go for you to make you look great. Studio lighting, everything's already around. So you pretty much have to just show up. This is Moon Men DJS. Don't just settle people. Book with us today, moonmanonline.com, and we'll see you on the next time.